Boom. What up, Solar Connected only here back doing some more League of Legends action. We are playing. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. That's what I thought. <laughs> We're playing some more to the top lane. I'm going for a sustained more build with the uh, new de uh, new death stance, rather. So we're going to go Death Stance. We're going to get Gunblade as well, obviously. We're going to have our W for healing. We got... Uh, I'll show you the runes in a second here. Ooh. We got Ravenous Hunter, obviously. We got Taste of Blood. We got Grasp Beyond Dime. We got Bone Plating, Revitalize. Shield Bash, obviously. Let's get a ward down. So the premise is we're going to sustain a ridiculous amount. As you usually do with this champion. All right, let's just keep pushing this guy in. I think we'll have some trouble last hitting. Maybe I'm wrong, but I feel like it's probably the best bet is to just perma shove him. Bit of a mistake. Hit him with the E whenever we can. Beautiful. So yeah, we're gonna have a ton of sustain. It's gonna be great. We're never gonna die, hopefully. Cut to dying eight times. Ooh. Just want to keep pushing the wave. Perma shoving. Can of minion. I get those. Sweet. Because every time we do this, we can just keep poking him. And then we always have our shield up. He's going to walk into it. Nice. Got the hit. Poke with E. Honestly, in this matchup. No, nah, never mind. I was going to say. It might be better to match a max E, but no. Nah. I can still just like insta clear waves. With W Max. He's putting all the pressure on him. He's got 13 CS. Not bad. It's obviously way easier for me to CS. Because I just perma shoved the wave. Alright, he's got 15. Not bad. He had to pop both of his potions though, and he's half HP. So I would classify that as winning lane. Again, immediately back into the shove. What he wants to try and do is what he's trying to do right now. Which is like slow push the wave back so it doesn't stack up as hard. Or like harass me. But I'm just dodging him while I push. It makes it quite difficult for him to deal with. He's going to miss some of these. The other thing you got to look at, look at his mana pool. It is disappearing rapidly. And again, just immediately start pushing. Dodge out on stuff. I shouldn't have used my W under tower. Because now I don't have it available. So it's making this push a little bit slower. Sweet. Auto Q. Beautiful. Run at him. Oh. There it is. Hit the E. If he walks up to any of these minions, I can toss my W on one and get the damage. Like that. Then I have a shield. Holy moly. Imagine if I took Ignite here. Whew. Oh, careful. Alright, push this wave in. I don't actually want to fight him. Well... I don't want to hit him right there. But I do want to keep the pressure up. Sweet. Yeah, we're up 10 CS right now. Just going to shove this next wave in as well. And then probably look to leave. Just alternate these hits. Sweet. Get this minion involved. Again, alternating hits. Beautiful. Let's just back right now. Force out his TP. Try again. There we go. <laughs> 42 to 26. He'll catch up a few here. Pretty good, pretty good. All right, so we're going Gunblade, like I said. You know, Gunblade first. Let's get this. Beautiful. Oh, he's behind him. Ooh, good shit, dude. I bet I don't want to steal all your wave. Good play, dude. Yeah, teleport, honestly, be very careful about that. That's a very, 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 very risky play. And, I, and I'll and i admit that I probably got a little bit lucky making it happen. Do not use your teleport bot lane unless you are 100% sure it's going to work. Because it's so risky now. With the, the fact that you can't cancel TP anymore. So, you know, imagine if... Imagine my TP is a half a second later, right? A half a second later, instead of being here where I can flash, hit him with the edge of my E... They're right here, and now I can't flash hit him with the edge of my E, and they both get away. I TP'd for essentially no reason. So be very, very careful with those teleports. 
Make sure the enemy is like truly overcommitted, or you have like a team with CC that can lock people down, or you have the movement speed to get over there. He's trying to shove the wave in, but I have to deny this by shoving myself. Sweet. Nice. All right. Keep the pressure on him. It's the next wave that matters the most. But I just want to be up here so I can start pushing it immediately. Try again, buddy boy. <laughs> I've been playing against Garthus a lot, so I've had a decent amount of practice dodging. Specifically on my main. Like, last week, you... Oh, I'm going to miss that because I want to poke him because I'm an idiot. I knew I was going to do that. Like, before it even happens, I know I'm already going to do it. I don't really think he wants to auto-attack me. Just get the W off of him. If he ever stands next to one of those minions, just hit him with that W. I feel like it's such an easy kill. Again, just going to push this wave instantly. Buff that minion behind me. The other thing I haven't mentioned is the minions... Oh. He's so low. I just don't know if I can, like, 100 to 0 him. I'm gonna do that. I tried to put my W on this minion. Kinda messed that one up, huh? He's so low, I just can't kill him with my R, though. It's not enough. If I had, like, Flash, Ignite, obviously I would go ham. Push this wave and get tower pressure. Oh, dude, he's... He's so lit! Whew. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know. Can't really do much here. Just gonna keep pushing. Damn, I really wish I had some jungle pressure. It'd be so free. Whatever. We're denying a lot of CS, though. So that's good, too. So that's gonna delay how hard he scales. I can get another tower plate here. Your Q uh, is an auto attack reset. So it's pretty useful for hitting towers. You don't get the extra Q damage on the tower, which is kind of unfortunate, but... It's pretty good. Say he's like sitting here next to me, right? And like I auto, I auto cue the tower. Then I have my second hit, and you know how your third hits the big one. Then I walk up and hit him with the third hit or something, right? You can make a play like that happen pretty easy. Uh, let's get this shoved in one more time. Perfecto. Sweet. Let's get out of here. I got Gunblade in the bank. Let's roll. Uh oh. It's fine. Sweet. Get a pink ward. Run back to the top lane. Alright, gonna go Death Stance next and then probably Visage. Visage, Visage is gonna amp all that healing that we're getting as well. But remember, this is gonna give us 15% of our damage done is uh, healed. So, pretty damn good. 15% of all this damage. And then Death Stance is gonna do the same thing. And then remember, we're a champion that has AD ratio. So, the Death Stance is gonna funnel into our damage as well. So, the Ghost gains attack damage. My E does more damage. See this, that orange number, the 78? That's the AD ratio. The 130, the 65, that's the AD ratio. <laughs> nice ult. Okay, never mind. Looks like it did work. Alright, we gotta try and pressure this without getting wrecked. Oh no. Alright, once we get him under tower, then we're good. Oh, that's kind of awkward. Just start walking away. Sweet. I just want to... Oh my god, I was like, what the fuck? I was, I was so confused. I was like, why is he moving? I thought I, I thought we killed him. Why is Garthus still... He's still alive! What's going on? Nope, that's your clone, you idiot. <laughs> Holy moly. They got the Infernal Dragon, which is pretty bad. But... What are you gonna do? Again, it's additional movement speed when you're running toward your clone. 75 extra. Alright. Nice, dude. You just got a double on them? Hell yeah. They still got that dragon, which sucks, but it's alright. Whew. Beautiful. First tower. Let's go. Keep shoving. Wanna back up a little bit. Pretty sure I kill him very quickly. 
Whew. All right, let's bail. I'm gonna get. Hmm. Oh, come on, man! Don't be an asshole. What have I ever done to you? Well, okay, I guess a little bit. <laughs> I could get boot upgrade here as well. Just go like this. I think that's what I'm gonna do, actually. Pretty solid buy. All right, let's roll. Really wanted that dragon, damn. We'll have to get the next one. Oh, shit. Yeah, I got you. Oh, this guy's insane. Wow, that guy got shit on. <laughs> A little goofball. That guy got popped. Uh, give me that 50 gold, Tibbers. <laughs> you don't have to have something... Like, you don't get the damage for the connection. When the two Ws are connected, think of like a Venn diagram, right? When the two Ws are connected, the two circles from them, you get the damage, right? So, see how the things go off the animation? I'd be dealing damage to anybody in that range. But you can also get damage just off the active part, right? The active part's the part that heals you. The other part's the part that gives shield and does damage. The active heals you and does damage as well. Ooh, well, hello there, Mr. Pinkboard. And another one? Wow. It's my lucky day. I love wards. Oh, bot lane, don't die, please. Oh, boy. Heck, does a lot. Oh, the exhaust. The exhaust is good. And he still kills him, yikes. <laughs> okay. The Hecarim damage is actually nutty. I've been playing a, a Hecarim Conqueror build that I'm going to try and get a video for. It does a lot of damage. A lot of damage. Whew. Level 11 ultimate. Sweet. Um. Woo! That poke, though. I feel like I can kill this guy very quickly. If I just get a little bit more poke on him. There is some. Dude, that third hit hit so hard. Holy shit, he's so mad. <laughs> oh my god. That third Q did so much damage. Jesus. I prepped up two of them on the minions beforehand. That way the third one was on him. And they tried to like walk up and get a Q on the minion like a goofball. And I take that as my Q to win. Oh. Oh, damn, nice play. Woo! Bail, bail, bail. Oh, you're crazy, man. Okay. Oh! Oh, shit! I got you with the heal! I gotta juke everything, though. Oh! <laughs> Flash that, bitch! Oh, my God, that damage, dude. I'm healing for so much. Get out of my face. Damn, I almost kept Yasuo alive. I W'd him and then I ran over into the minion, or into uh, Karthus, and I hit him with the uh, the hit, the W reactivation. So I got the trigger. Oh my god, how much gold are you? Jesus. 28. Holy moly. Alright, here we go. But now we got the 15% damage dealt here, 15% damage dealt here. It says unique pit, passive, but they both work together for some reason. It doesn't have an actual name. If it was unique passive, it, it just... It means you can't stack the same one. That's all this one means. Most unique passives have like an actual name, like lifeline or something. So then you can look and be like, oh, well, this has lifeline, and so does Steric Gage. I can't take Steric Gage and Maw at the same time. But these ones don't work that way. So you get both of the... Benefit and then you're also getting the benefit here, which is another 14% of current healing. So we have 14% 15% 15% taste of blood procs grasping undying procs revitalize amp amplifying everything Come on man. Oh What I didn't know that if you self ult and then there's a target near you it gives it to them later on or not self ult sorry a Self W Wow, I didn't know that. Oh, we should 100% be doing dragon. I'm pretty sure Yasuo can 1v1, but... I'd 
the most intelligent thing. Alright. Sweet. Let's do this. This is really big. Watch how OP this dragon is. Well, I wonder if the dragon shares with my, uh... Life steal and shit, you know? Uh, or we can just walk mid. Both are decent. I get 75 movement seed and I'm running toward... Whatever circle is running toward the other circle gets 75 movement seed. Oh! You do not want to fight me at all. You crazy, man. Remember, keep microing this guy. One hit. Two hit. I can kill this guy in a second. Ooh. Gotta be a little careful here, boys. We're okay. Dude, I was putting in so much work. If you didn't fear me, I'd self W on him for another heal. You heal for a lot, boys. I'm trying to tell you this. You heal for a lot, okay? <laughs> you live forever. Now we're gonna amp the healing even more. And this is gonna be a great item against their team because they have quite a bit of magic damage as well. So we're gonna amp up with Spirit Visage. Remember, all this healing, now we're gonna amp it by 30%. Increases all healing received by 30%. So this is now increased by 30%. This is increased by 30%. This is increased. By 30%, by 30%, by 30%. All of it. Very good. And then we're reducing the magic damage that we take as well. Which is quite useful. Hmm. I might just TB. Hmm. Oh. That's not good. That was a big shutdown. Oh, never mind. There's only 550. I thought it was way bigger. They need to back in mid, though. They are going to be in some trouble in a second. This guy's staying on the side like that. It's kind of rough. They could easily walk this way and get him. Ooh. Heck I'm going to go mid to group up with these guys. You got to be careful here. Annie can still blow everybody up. And she's really strong. She's a lot of damage. Oh, shit. So we're waiting for Annie to flash on this guy in one shot. <laughs> yeah. Keeping him alive with the heal. Holy moly. Be careful there, my friend. Let's speed this guy up. No, you crazy man. I got a new horse. Yippee. I've always wanted a horse. No, my horse. Oh my God, they killed my horse. I can't believe you've done this. I mean, we can fight this shit all day, dude. Oh! My god. Where'd he go? <laughs> Where did he go? Nobody knows. Adios, buddy boy. I want to get really low HP so I can see how much uh, my W heals for. Because my W is going to heal for such a ridiculous amount. Because we have the double spell vamp and like all the other shit. And the W itself already heals for an absurd amount plus gives shield. I want to test it. I want to get real low and kill everybody. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to go over here. I want to just farm the rest of the side out real quick. So I can get that max amp. Sweet. Walk this way. Just E as I leave. Easy peasy. Oh boy. Don't die, buddy. That cannon is actually really strong. Oh boy. Yeah, we don't want any of this fight. I just want to leave. Well, I'm actually like 30 gold away from my item. Or more than I thought, rather. Alright, I'm just going to back real quick. And TP. Don't worry, friend. Out. I will TP. I see like two seconds here. Well, alrighty then. And then they end. <laughs> I don't know. End. 
interesting. Maybe not the greatest play ever, but hey. You <laughs> could just wait a second. I don't think they can do anything here. I ulted that guy, but I don't know if I can catch him. Yeah, I'm healing through all this guy's damage. Oh, fuck! Ah, the CC. CC and Ignite, that'll get you. It's more just I can't get to anybody. They're all really, really fast. Well, I'm getting CC'd the whole time. Alright, let's just group up, you goofballs. Holy, I should just finish this. What am I doing? We could add double supers in every wave. Yikes. That was a huge mistake. The difference in pressure is... Oh, it's ridiculous. Because it's not... You're not just doubling the pressure. Because these things have a buff where they're amplifying the minions around them. So if you have two near each other, they're buffing the other super minion. So it's even more than just doubling the value of having two super minions in a lane. So yeah, that was a big fuck up. Trying too hard to go in there. But I just got ignited and it was just like a wrap from there. Because I got ignited and then hit by the flay into the death sentence. So I just couldn't get my E off or anything. It was rough. I'm going to get a little bit of armor here going to like a Zhonya's. Oh, try again. Get a little armor going to Zhonya's. Ooh! Yeah, we can do that. Or we can just drag him. Oh! The one shot? That'll do. That'll do. We can just end here. Going for the end. Annie, the last hope. Oh my god! I bet she didn't have a stun available. Might have been able to actually do that. Oh shit, dude. This Annie's like actually carrying them. What? <laughs> they can actually hold this kind of. Dude, Annie's killing everybody. What the fuck? What is happening? Annie the god. Yeah, I'm with you, dude. Oh, man. I don't know if I can beat this Annie. Oh, fuck. Get him, Caitlyn. Get him, Caitlyn. Get him, Caitlyn. Let's go. Me and Caitlyn got this. Oh, got hit this guy. Whew. All right, they, that guy does a lot of damage. <laughs> oh. All right, we got the double supers. We're good. Can we five, man? It's, they don't wait for me. I don't wait for them. I try in 1v5, they try in 4v5. Alright. We just walk here. We have supers in every lane. We're gonna go for Zonya's next, like I was saying. Whew. I also wasn't dodging any of the Karthus Qs there. I think I... No, I guess I only ate one. Okay, maybe I was dodging. Oh god, that guy's done though. Even missed the W. Don't matter. Adios, buddy boy. They can probably just walk and end now, after that kill. Yeah. They can probably just walk and end. You just wait for the inhib. It's not a big deal. Dude, <laughs> late game ADC with your R. Well, the thing is, remember, because we're going for the AD build, the Ghost is doing even more damage. You see that Ghost gains 132 auto attack damage, right? That's from our AD ratios. That's from the AD here and the AD here. So... Mike, why are you not building AP? It's like, you don't have to on this guy. He's a hybrid. And look at that 363, that extra damage is from the AD. That 156 is from the AD. It's quite good. You don't have the huge burn from your R, but when you do kill the ghost, the ghost does a shitload of damage. So if you can kill like an AD carry, right? An AD carry with extra attack damage, pretty fucking good. Oh. Are they not gonna fight? Come on! Gunblade. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, what the fuck? Dude, this Andy's a god. We're trolling so hard right now. Super minions, do it! Oh my god, we're trolling so hard. Holy shit. <laughs> what happened to Kane there?
Did he die? <laughs> Holy shit. Alright, I got TP. I'll just TP in the back door myself. I got this. Why not buy a Warmogs? Why would I want to buy a Warmogs, my man? I would much rather have a Seeker's Arm Guard into a Zanya's. Be much better. Why would I want a Warmogs? Yeah. I don't know why I'd want a Warmogs. Uh, we're going to sell this and get this. It's going to be quite useful. And it's second. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. I'm just gonna go get the dragon. If I have the dragon, I can, like, literally 1v5. Alright. What happens if you lose this game? There's literally zero chance we can lose this game, my man. I'm telling you, if I get the dragon, I can just 1v5. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Wait for me, or I don't get... Yeah, you gotta wait for me. I'm not gonna get it. TY, TY. Alright, now we can just walk it down. We can just wait 16 seconds on this guy. <laughs> Go forth, my dragon! Slay all! Oh, hello, Annie. Come on, Annie, stop running away! Where are you going? Lazy Olten. I'm just going for the end. Fuck you. <laughs> We're about to like dive the Nexus and lose. Not today, baby. Not today. Alright, man. That, that sustain is ridiculous. If you go against a matchup that's like an actual melee champion and you can use your grasp a lot more often and you get trades a lot more often. I mean, the, the, what I did is how you're supposed to play against a ranged champion. It's kind of annoying, maybe a little bit boring, but you have to just constantly push and you have to go for like the CS advantage. And you can dive them after you poke a lot, but... You know, your jungle has to be on top side of the map for that to happen. So it's not always going to happen or whatever, but it's pretty good. I will take it. I will take it. The young S. Whew. Let's go. I want to see healing. Yeah, Annie, like, did a ton of damage. Not more than me. Ne never, never more than me. I'm always number one damage. Okay. Yeah, 17,000 healing. Okay. Okay. That's reasonable. Reasonable. Um, Where's, like, damage? Self-mitigated damage. Wait, what? 48,953 self-mitigated damage. Okay. That's one tanky dude. Jesus. What? All right. That's actually absurd. I like that. I like that a lot. Here are the runes again if you wanted to see them. Like I said, next item would have just been Seeker's Arm Guard. Or, uh, sorry, Sonya's. And then from there, you can kind of build whatever you want for the last item. If you need, like, a Rylize, Rylize would be pretty solid to, like, keep up with people. You go Void Staff, you go... Literally, you can do whatever you want. GA, you can even go with, like, Triforce or something. Because this is a relatively 80 heavy route anyways. But, yeah. This is the runes. That's Mord. Full sustain. Beastly Mord in the top lane. A little bit long on the end, but, hey, whatever. GG, well played. If you guys enjoyed that one you're watching on YouTube right now, make sure to like the video and subscribe for more content like this. If you're watching over on Twitch right now, make sure to follow the live stream. And click to see if you got a free Twitch Prime sub available by clicking the subscribe button at the top of your screen and redeeming that free sub if you got one. Or if you have Amazon Prime, you can connect your Amazon Prime to your Twitch account and get Twitch Prime for free, allowing you to sub once a month to the streamer of your choice. Pick me. <gasps> okay. Anyways, GG Well Played. Hope you guys enjoyed that one. Make sure to tune in next time. Peace.